When I was a boy growing up in London, we had stereoscopes in the house. There was a big wooden cabinet stereoscope which took glass slides and there were many smaller ones. And, um, um, uh, and there were pictures from grand sites all over the world, but also of historical occasions. And somehow looking into the stereoscope, one could lose oneself completely. It, you know, it formed a sort of vicarious travel. Um, and um, I am um, either because it was built into me or because I practiced a lot, the sense of apparent depth became greater and greater for me. I also found that if I closed one eye briefly, the world flattened out and, and expanded in an amazing way. Um, this apparently didn't happen with with, with other kids, you know, and, and nine out of ten kids would say, so I close one eye, it makes no difference. But, but um, one out of ten, <laughs> like myself, would feel that it made a huge amount of difference. Stereo was quite a strong part of my life, as in another way music was. Due to some problems in my right eye, um, I lost central vision there, and with that, Basically, I lost the use of that eye, and I lost stereoscopy at the age of 75, having been a strong stereo all my life. Um, this hit me, and continues to hit me very hard in all sorts of ways. Um, I, I find myself in a, in an, a maddeningly flat world. Um, and, um, uh, and it causes me many difficulties. Um, for example, I, I see steps only as lines on the ground. I can't tell whether they go up or down. There is no longer any up or down. Um, uh, um, yesterday, as uh, I was driving, I can't drive myself now. I'm, I'm only a passenger. Um, I was amazed to see a large arrow uh, apparently on the windscreen of the car. Um, the car had recently been in for checking and I thought they'd put this arrow on the windscreen. The arrow turned out to be 50 foot away. But for me, flat. Uh, I couldn't, there was no longer any space between the windscreen of the car and that 50 foot. And so there was in fact an absurd conflation and the thing was seen uh, on the windscreen of the car. Um, basically, for my, for me now, everything is a is a plane. Um, I no longer see objects residing in space with space in between them at different levels. I see a sort of collage of uh, uh, of shapes and colours and movements, all basically on a, on a plane. I manage okay with difficulty, but. Um, uh, but, uh, but I'm very conscious now, uh, in reverse, of what a wonderful gift stereoscopy is, what a blessing, how one tends to take it for granted, and what trouble one is in if it's been uh, a strong gift all one's life and it's then gone.